Yeah, welcome back to the channel, Be Quanchi here. Uh, back at again, doing another video uh, looking at AR generated art um, that I made up, uh, prompted, whatever you want to call it. Um, and this time, it's as you can see, it's uh, with Donkey Kong. Um, before I get into it, I always like to say the best way to support me in the channel is to like, comment, and subscribe, which you can on YouTube, X, Twitter, Twitch, where I do uh, game streams and get uploaded back here to uh, YouTube as bods. And I also like to say, uh, when it comes to AI art, I know it can be kind of a polarizing uh, topic to talk about. I always uh, believe, you know, uh, supporting artists, real artists and all that. Um, I do find it interesting to experiment with uh, AI art just to see what it pops out with. It. Um, so a lot of these uh, goals of the video is to um, experiment, uh, critique, uh, document. Uh, a lot of it's like not perfect. I'm definitely going to have my criticism. I do find it kind of interesting. Um, I am saving these pictures on my hard drive, so if there's ever demand to have them like reposted, I'm very tempted to do like a, a side uh, social media account or blog. So let me know in the comments below and all that. But just going to have fun. I did uh, download these after like making, I did use the Dolly 3 with it being AI. Uh, so uh, uh, that's where they're coming from, but I definitely have my critiques and all that, and I can explain some of the prompts I uh, did uh, along the way. I did one with Bowser recently too, so that's on the channel, but I might do more of this. It, it, I think it's fun to play around with, but I don't uh, view it as a substitute for actual art and all that. But let's just get to it. Um, I'm never going to repeat some things with my criticism with this Donkey Kong one, but let's go to the first one. Uh, okay, this one I did a prompt for Donkey Kong on the beach. Uh, not terrible. It just uh, seems kind of simple. It's it kind of looks like a toy. I did a lot of the prompts I did. I added in Nintendo style at the uh, end of it, which kind of helped out a lot. Um, I just feel like Donkey Kong. He's like too like his proportions are really off. Like he's brown and pudgy and all that. The face looks decent. Uh, maybe the uh, legs look a little off in terms of the positioning. Uh, not too terrible. Uh, besides Do Donkey Kong's body. Uh, let's go to the next one. This one, it seems a little off. It looks, at least his proportions are better. I just said Donkey Kong on the beach. I don't know what the hell all this is going on. Uh, why he's holding like a bacon burger, um, the juice, whatever, donuts. Um, looks like fighter jets or uh, airliners or something like that. It, it's really weird. Like, um, if we take out all these, maybe this tree right here, like this palm tree right here, is really, really weird too. Uh, a lot of times with the Donkey Kong uh, and AI generations I got, they mess up on the title a lot in terms of the logo. I believe it's supposed to be DK, but a lot of times they try to slap on the uh, Nintendo logo. Um, it always looks off, so we never. I don't think I've ever got a perfect uh, Donkey Kong tie. Um, I, I, I think I look. I don't know. He has that too, like. Uh, Merge together as one like eye, so I think that's kind of weird. Uh, besides that, not too bad with his wait one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> he have too many toes, he has too many toes on this foot. Um, just one from the side, I guess it looks okay, but I just noticed that now because I look at uh, these a little bit before uh, making these videos and all that. But random stuff like him holding a burger, these donuts in the sky, six toes, kind of a weird one. This one, it's not too bad, but we have this weird uh, Donkey Kong, this little mini one. Uh, it's kind of random in the background, but it's kind of like really nothing I can't really make out. Um, he kind of have his weird, like, muscly uh, torso. Besides that, not too bad when you look at his head shape. Um, maybe the banana is kind of small, uh, how he's holding it. Uh, not too bad. I was kind of looking at his like little swimsuit uh, with a little mini Donkey Kong. It looks like he has like a strap or something, which looks weird with his head. Um, I'm not sure what he's holding. Like if it's just like a piece of candy or something. Miss, but not too bad. But like this is a little one. I think maybe one of the better ties. Uh, you can see he's going for DK, but it's still really, really off. Uh, but yeah, I just think like this had this random Donkey Kong right here. Uh, not too terrible, but I, I just don't like the stomach. How it looks kind of weird, like buff and muscly, um, in comparison to like what you expect from Donkey Kong. But let's go to the next one. 
Uh, this one's fine. I think it just looks off weird. I don't think they added a G. This, I just realized now that this one is probably one of the other uh, better ties that this AI uh, generated. They gave him a little swimsuit. His feet look kind of weird. I know like monkeys have like hands, uh, feet that got like hands, but I'm not sure with that, with that gorilla. I need to uh, look things up. But also, yeah, this weird, um, it looks like a juice box, but they make it look like a Game Boy. And I'm not sure if that's supposed to be like a punch out game. It kind of reminds me of like King Hippo. Um, but the one thing this is going to happen a lot is like weird Nintendo stuff that pops up. It might be because I put in um, a Nintendo style for most of the prompts and all that. Um, not incredibly bad, just like messing up the tie again. His hands look decent. His feet look really weird. I think that's one thing. Like it, his feet are really, really weird. And it's some random stuff in the uh, background. Okay, this next one, uh, I did put uh, Donkey Kong surfing. So this is a new uh, prompt. Not too bad. I kind of like his pose. His feet look weird. But this, a lot of times it would give him a tail, which I don't know why it does that. So um, I guess the wave looks kind of, it's kind of like a simplest art style. Uh, not too bad. But also this thing with his hand here. I'm not sure that's like an extra finger. That's going to be the tail. But it looks like he's trying to give him like a headband or bandana. But it's just the back end of it. So I'm not sure what this red thing is. Um, not too bad. But I think the tail, the feet, and this whatever headband thing that is like popping out of his back of his head. This one's pretty good. It, it for some reason did it more like a toy style. Like this is something I can expect from a Happy Meal or stuff like that. Mm. I look like it's off it position wise. Um, okay. Feet look not too bad. Like I think this looks more bad. Like uh, when his feet look more like feet versus like hands. Um, and you had this weird thing like the surfboard turning to a, a waterway. This feels like a toy you can like uh, has wheels that you can pull back and release. Uh, not terrible, but again, you can see the DK tie is uh, messed up too with the logo. But it's kind of weird how um, with the same prompts, like you get different outcomes with this more looking like a, an actual toy. This one's pretty cool. Like, for some reason, it got two Donkey Kongs. Like, two Donkey Kongs. Uh, not too bad with the background. I'm not sure why they're randomly holding bananas and throwing that in the water. Again, the ties mess up. I feel like this hand, his hang pen, this one doesn't look bad at all. Um, this one does. I'm not sure what's going on with that hand. But again, you can see the eyes are messed up. Uh, the logo. It looks like it's going back to trying to do the Nintendo logo. But the surfboard on the water doesn't look too bad. Um, I think overall, like, Donkey Kong doesn't look bad either. Just, like, some weird stuff with the hands. I'm not sure what the mouth. It looks like his mouth is closed, but then it's open. So I just noticed that now. Like, uh, his mouth looks good because it's clearly open. But this one looks really weird. Like, is, is that a weird shadow? Is that um, open but also closed? Um, yeah, definitely some issues with this one. Okay, this one I like a lot. Uh, this one I think I just put uh, Donkey Kong in a swimsuit. And one that's a really simple 2D style. I'm actually a little impressed with this drink because he's holding it. It looks good. The drink looks good. Like the straw is facing him. Cute little effect there. Uh, I'm not sure if these are supposed to be goggles because it goes around the back of his head. Um, not bad. I think the knot in his swim trunks is really weird. Um, you kind of give him this like long hair in the back too. Um, kind of cool, but I think this may be one of the better generations I got for this video. This one actually turned out pretty good, too. Um, again, back to a simple 2D design. Uh, actually, this is really hard to fault, uh, besides maybe the knot in the swim trunks. Uh, actually, a pretty decent one. Like uh, His hair is a little bit more unique. Uh, it's at the one point, but um, actually not bad when it does it really simple. Like... There's no background or anything like that. Um, kind of like the thick outlines, kind of like the style. So this one, I, I'm going to give a compliment for AI for this one. This one is pretty cute, too. Um, I kind of like the, wait, did I? No, I'm thinking of a different one, uh, I think, with with uh, this prompt. This one's pretty good. Um, proportions look good. They make them a, a little bit more buff. Uh, the expression. Background's kind of random, but it makes sense. 
Um, I think if we were honest, we'd probably make something a little bit better with the background. I'm not sure what's going on with this tank top. Like, this was a swimsuit, but I gave him a tank top, too. Again, you got the messed up uh, logo. I'm not sure what these little buttons are. Um, but this one, for the most part, pretty good. But there's uh, it's little complaints here and there. Um, but not too bad when you look just at uh, Donkey Kong. This one's cute. It, it's simple. Um, it can even more like a, a one piece or a singlet. Um, I believe this is the swimsuit uh, prompt again. Uh, I think when it goes really simple, it's hard to really find too many faults. Um, yeah, but not too bad. I'm looking at the hands and feet and maybe look kind of weird. Um, but it is not too atrocious. Uh, this is, again, a little bit better one when it goes really simple. This one um, I like a lot. Um, I'm sure if it gives like a swim trunks and a singlet or this is a one piece. I kind of I really like this outfit for uh, Donkey Kong. Um, he's wearing a headband, which doesn't look too bad. The Nintendo logo is almost spot on, but you can see the E, the O looks really off. Um, maybe he's holding a random SNES game. I did not prompt that. Um, he just I just added there. It was like Donkey Kong in a swimsuit in Nintendo style. Um, it's like you're trying to sell your game. I think how it's this position that doesn't make sense. I mean, does it looks a little off at how you would actually be holding it. This is what I was thinking out. The one blaring thing is right here by his eye. How uh, this doesn't have the lighter um, part of his face. Like how he has a little uh, outline. Um, and I should call this skin, but it's just uneven how you can see it here. But on this side, it's missing. That is like a blaring mistake with this one, but I think a cute one. Um, I like it, but it's that's probably the biggest thing that's like, eh, this is a, a fail when it comes to AI. Um, this one pretty good too. Um, I would say maybe the knot, the tie, obviously. For some reason, it gives them a nipple on this side, but no nipple on that side. Um, yeah, it, it, for some reason, with this probably went a lot of 2D uh, style with it. Uh, his eye looks kind of weird, but it's uh, covered by the shades. Um, it makes sense. Uh, maybe I ex expect his shades to be bigger. Uh, maybe not. It's I think random one nipple is probably the weirdest thing about it. Um, I think that's like a life. I'm not sure if that's like a bottle of a soda, one of those lifeguard things that they use as a flotation. Um, all that. You have Donkey Kong eating pizza. Um, this one's kind of cute. It kind of gives him more of a toy style. Um, I'm sure the feet look really small compared to his hands. Uh, so his proportions look a little weird. Not too bad with the face. It, it gave this random uh, uh, banana uh, right here with the pizza, this crust. It's like this extra crust or that doesn't make sense. So this pizza slice is off. Too bad. One thing I really wish it would do is it would like actually take a slice from the pizza. Because this doesn't make sense if you're eating pizza and still have a full pizza in front of you, at least looking at the image. Um, and it's like really simple too. I think it's supposed to be like pepperonis or like basil, um, extra mozzarella, uh, all that. I have this juice box, but you can tell the straw doesn't go through. So it doesn't make sense. You expect a straw to go all the way through the drink if you're going to have a, a, straw, uh, a straw attached to the lid. So I think that's a little weird um, with that. You know, I, this looks pretty cool too. Um, I just noticed this part of his mouth looks really weird, like with a tooth, and it doesn't quite make sense. Um, so this could have been fixed up a lot more. He's coming up a tie with the pizza, so you can't see the imperfection. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on with here. Like, oh, hey, the finger looks kind of weird. All that. The pizza has more detail. You can tell, like, the basil leaf. Uh, it looks like it's supposed to be tomatoes. Um, I've got some random stuff too. I'm not sure where these little brown pieces are. Um, all that. But it's also doing the thing, like I said, like he's holding a full pizza, but he also has a pizza slice. So it doesn't make sense. He should have one slice missing from the whole pizza. A little bit better with the detail with the cheese. Uh, it looks a little kind of like random and almost like questionable with some of these toppings. Uh, clear. Again, the, the part of his mouth like really messes up the DK uh, render. Um, not terrible, but that that just be, ruins it right there. <laughs> this one I find silly. Uh, they made him uh, a little pudgy. Uh, the logo on the tie is totally messed up. 
I'm not thinking of little cross-eyed face. We look kind of silly. They have these like flying pizza slices. Um, I'm gonna symbol just mostly for pepperoni. I'm not sure if the green is supposed to be basil again. The green of strawberries is like broken pieces of stuff, like a potted plant, I think. At least the pot part. Um, look like this is a nest controller, which is like all messed up, isn't it? I don't know why it gave to this again. It might be just be putting Nintendo style, but this is like a TV. Um, kind of reminds me of uh, like new Super Mario Brothers series. Um, don't, don't know why there's magic TVs here and all that, but I thought that was kind of strange when he's like facing away from it, like eating a whole pizza. Um, all that. It, I think the pizza it make more sense if it's actually more biting down. It's like the pizza stretching like he's biting into it, but his mouth is more open. So I think I would have his mouth closed more so that makes sense or uh, make this pizza more random. Because you can see like the pizza crust too kind of disappears on this top half. Uh, it makes it look like he's trying, like biting from it and pulling it, but he's not really biting down. So that doesn't make sense right there. But the DK model's not too bad. Um, this with how he's interacting with pizza and of course the tie again. <laughs> I like this one a lot. Um, this one is silly. It's I still think it's off. Um, his proportion. It, I just noticed uh, they try to give him a tail again. He too. So I don't know why he's giving him a tail. This hand's fucked. It's messed up. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five. Extra fingers on this hand. The pizza looks uh, okay for the style. Um, got kind of like random toppings and all that, but. It's like a half um, pizza and half pan, which doesn't make sense at all. And then you have this weird nest controller down here, which has like a plug that plugs into itself. Um, definitely get off from, it looks like it's trying to go for a nest controller, um, but it's just completely off. And it looks like it's giving him a belly button, but it looks off center here. And I'm not sure if that's, I think that's supposed to be nipple or sweat. So I do like the doofy face. I, I think the mouth. It's kind of off with like the, showing his teeth and then close to closed mouth. So I think this part of the mouth looks really weird. I kind of like the extra stars, like little lines here, the silly face, um, all that. But yeah, there's a lot of issues, especially this hand. It's trying to give him a tail. Um, belly buttons off, it, I feel like. Uh, but yeah. And a silly one. Um, I think not too bad. I think the hands look a little. I think this one looks off. It, it kind of goes more simpler. Kind of why he has green shit in his mouth. Like he's not eating anything with green topping. Could look like he had a pizza, uh, a basic pepperoni. But again, he takes a slice. to still a full pizza. Uh, that, that's my little nerf uh, complaint. Um, give him fat belly. This belly button makes a little bit more sense here. How this one's positioned. I'm not sure why he says NK for his tie, but there's that. Then he's in the nest controller. This one actually makes a little bit more sense. I'm not sure with this black line here, but this looks like a nest controller, but it looks like the plug is on the side and not from the top. This one, uh, Donkey Kong eating ice cream. Uh, this one's cute. It's simple, so this one's kind of hard to fault too much. Uh, I think this is a weird tree in the background. This looks kind of cut off. Uh, it does the thing weird thing with food, like he has a little bit of ice cream on a spoon, but um, his ice cream looks like it's completely un uh, untouched. So I think that's just like a little nitpick. Uh, kind of, I think that's like a cherry, maybe like a mint leaf. Um, I feel like he should be holding the spoon a little bit more towards his mouth, like like he's like facing it away from him, so the spoon's position seems more twisted towards the camera, for lack of a better word. If they were playing ties, it's kind of hard to fold the tie that it doesn't have a logo. Which is kind of fun, but I think not, not too bad for a DK render for looking at Donkey Kong himself. <laughs> it's silly. Uh, look, he has this like white, I think maybe that's supposed to be saliva or drool, but I'm not sure. I didn't say anything about banana. I just said him eating ice cream. And he had this weird uh, Nintendo console, which looks like maybe a SNES. It's hard to tell. It's a funny expression on his face. He <laughs> put bananas in there. His feet look really weird and lumpy. Uh, almost looks like maybe a fun style choice. But the big thing you can see with his ice cream cone is that it like there's the tip of it, but it doesn't make sense with his how he's holding it. Like maybe I would hide it or make it his hand position to look like it makes more sense to the ice cream tip of the cone completely off. 
Ty looks really short. That Ty looks really off to you. Funny, funny expression. Um, it looks like it's going for more goofy style. So maybe the feet look weird, but maybe you can just chalk it up for like a weird goofy style. But I think this thing is like a weird creation. Why I did this, I don't know. This one's not too bad. It's kind of simple. With how it's zoomed in, you can't really tell. I think the tie still looks messed up, but the logo's cut off. Um, I think his teeth look weird, like especially like he has like two teeth on the top. Um, yeah, this one makes a little bit more sense. Uh, it has like weird. I'm not sure if there's like a, maybe uh, a Japanese thing or, or like when they put in Nintendo. It's got this weird orange ball, which I'm not supposed to not sure if that's like a little candy or gumball or something. And these little mint leaves, but not besides his teeth in his mouth, not too bad for Donkey Kong. I kind of like the fur texture and all that. So not too bad. Just like the <laughs> he ate too much ice cream and lost some teeth. He needs to go see a dentist, I guess. This one. OK, yeah, his mouth looks really weird, too. You can see the weird teeth underneath his tongue. The pie's messed up. Uh, and, I, and ice cream it looks like he you should have more on the spoon i don't know and the spoon looks a little warped here too um and quite interesting with this world like i, I don't think you can get ice cream looking like that way it goes from pink to blue it makes a fun uh, color design the bulb ice cream looks good i don't know if i make this green uh color like a huge scoop i threw in a random banana the banana actually looks good it looks like it has like a good uh uh, perspective on it. And we have this weird, I'm not sure that's supposed to be like a Game Boy or something or some Nintendo game thing, but it throws it at random with these generations and all that. So you think the mouth is like, again, another fuck up with the AI. He has three toes here. He has four toes here. Um, again, with his hands, like it's uneven. Like he has like, this hand looks good, but this one's short of finger and all that. So a lot of uh, imperfections with this one. Okay, the Super Saiyan prompt. I did this for the Bowser one. Um, I did it for Donkey Kong. Um, not too bad. I don't like you give this friend like it gave, again two Donkey Kongs. I'm not sure why we get to see two Donkey Kongs. Um, not too bad with the clenched fist. Uh, maybe this thumb looks a little off. Um, the feet look a little off a little bit in terms of like toes or whatever. But the tail for some reason it gave him a tail. And when they give him Super Saiyan three. And all that for the transformation. This one just looks like he's uh, powering up. Like maybe he's um, a pupil of Donkey Kong. And all that. But the tie looks kind of weird. But I guess you can see with like the energy era. That make kind of makes sense. Uh, kind of a body. But not too terrible. I think that tail is the biggest uh, glaring mistake with this AI. This one looks good. It looks more simple. Um, all that so it kind of had to follow. it gives kind of like because it looks like it, it a lot of times when i put the uh, super saiyan it tries to imitate goku with like the hairstyle and also his gi and all that i think maybe the toes look a little weird with that you can, you can see with the hands three and four here in the thumb and this is probably my biggest complaint like you see his uh gi it looks like it's like merging to his fur when it comes to the pants so sometimes some of them were like little torn. It makes sense. But this looks really off. Uh, just having his uh, pants kind of turn into his fur. Um, if it's like the sleeves, the is sleeveless. Um, the for the top looks good. But the pants look really awful um, with this one. This one's silly. <laughs> it's not too bad. I, I can get with the tie with the symbol. Um, I think the feet look kind of weird. It's like, like this one. You can see that the pants are clearly torn, uh, showing his fur and his legs. This knuckles looks weird. I don't know what that's going on. Like it's like two thumbs, all that. Uh, this is this. I can only assume it's supposed to be a tail, but it's totally like doesn't make any sense at all. Besides that, it looks like a tail, but it looks like it's coming out of his arm. Then you got this atrocity. I don't know what the hell this is. It looks like it's going for. But Super Saiyan 3 um, transformation, the arm looks weird. I'm not sure if this is supposed to be human or what, if this is supposed to be Goku. Um, I don't know, it's kind of interesting with the headband, but you can see right here, the knot on the headband doesn't make sense. You see these three little uh, points when it should be two. So this one was kind of a silly one I wanted to add as well. This one, 
Interesting. Um, again, for some reason, it did two Donkey Kongs. The one in the background looks, I could like this one a lot. Um, if we're going Super Saiyan 3, um, getting the Saiyan armor, it kind of gives this Donkey Kong a simpler look. The hair looks a little weird. Um, again, it gave him feet that kind of look more like hands, but again, the tail. I hate seeing this tail on Donkey Kong. That doesn't make sense. I don't know why the AI is doing that. But I like this background one a lot um, for a Donkey Kong uh, like Super Saiyan. This one, uh, simple. This one, I think maybe it's a little hard to tell with this perspective, this hand, but it looks like it did a three fingers and four fingers. Uh, I think this is the weirdest part, like uh, below the belt. I think we'd still see like the skin colored torso, but it kind of cuts off. So I think that's kind of weird. I think maybe because it gave him more like a taller human like uh, portion. Uh, maybe the teeth is a little off too. Uh, not too, too terrible. I think the head shape's kind of off too. Mm. Now that I'm look at it, it's kind of like, you know, it's off in a lot of different ways, but not so obvious with this one this one not too bad um kind of beside the tie looking really weird with the position i would just got rid of that tie um maybe because it kind of like close up crop up too um, i think it's interesting that they made his spiky hair more like donkey kong's color not like a golden uh, traditional super saiyan so this is pretty interesting i think the Eyes like the blaring issue, and maybe the proportion of the gi make, make, maybe it makes sense, uh, but it looks kind of uneven um, with the top of the gi and the tie. I would just get rid of that tie. It looks awful in this generation. But I, again, the hair looks interesting that it kept with the, the color of his fur. Not too bad. This one, I did the JoJo's Bizarre Adventure prompt again, like I did with Bowser. Um, it did add a lot of the symbols, the kanji, even though this kanji probably doesn't make sense at all. Um, give him like a really buff body. His hands look a little weird. And that's with Donkey Kong. I did try to give him some of the weird like poses. Um, we'll see more of that. Um, the tail, the dreaded tail on his back again. And this one doesn't make sense. It doesn't look, it looks like it's off, like it's coming off of his leg and not his butt. And then got this weird like, I'm not sure if these like these bags of like bananas or other fruit. An interesting hat. His pupils are kind of off-colored, which is I maybe mean, that's a style choice. That's this looks weird to me. Um, not too bad with the outfit, but kind of give him like almost like a singlet again. And the logo again looks uh, off. I'm not sure. It looks like do like do. Oh, let's go to the next one. This one actually, I, I thought this was really funny. Uh, it gave this. It made up a JoJo character. Um, I just said Donkey Kong as a character in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. I'm pretty sure I said in anime style. Maybe I didn't. I forget. But this character looks pretty good for JoJo. Um, and it, it, for this one, it makes it seem like Donkey Kong's maybe his stand. Um, it doesn't look bad. I think just because it's like close up and propped, I think this area underneath Donkey Kong's neck looks really weird. And like, how's. His, I think this is his arm, but it looks like his like torso. I almost feel like it's trying to make him more like a buff body, but it looks like blob of nothing that does make sense um you need to see the kanji i like this look for donkey kong this expression so this one i like to think if it's uh someone had donkey kong for a stan for the stan's ability but the jojo character looks actually pretty good okay this one not too bad so it looks it looks again he kind of like doing a po fighting pose all the kanji his eyes the same color this time uh not too much. Uh, it, again, it, it did a thing with the hands. Uh, three fingers, four fingers on that one. Um, because it's like random. The tie looks kind of like torn, which doesn't make sense. Um, probably the one of the blurry thing is this knot with his headband. Has like on a completely different side when they should be like right next to each other. They're not visible. And all that. Because that doesn't make sense to have like this part of the knot here. And that's what I'm assuming. Unless they, yeah, the headband looks really weird. I'm getting kind of interesting hair, but a fun one but a lot of things off with it this one it's kind of simple again did kind of like a zoom in it kind of gave him this long hair and like a jojo style jacket uh, hat's kind of simple um have these random stars and symbols the hand looks messed up looks like he's trying to pose but 
Not, yeah, this, this especially with this finger, it looks really weird. Um, because it's feeling off, it's like not too many imperfections you can really see with it kind of zoomed in on uh, the render. This one, <laughs> yeah, this one's funny because this hand is the blaring thing that came up with me. Like, it had extra fingers. Like, I know it's supposed to go like a fist or two fingers or what, but it's like combined like three different hand sign. Um, it's really interesting. Um, hairstyle looks good. Um, I think they made him way too tall. That's like kind of looks weird, kind of muscle structure here, but those are way too many abs. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. He has a 12 pack, not a six pack. He, he, he a 12 pack that does not make any sense. His hand on his waist looks okay. Maybe the thumb looks kind of off, like how it's visible. Uh, maybe not. Uh, Besides, I would crank him down so he's not so he doesn't have such a tall torso because his arms look pretty good with kind of like the buff kind of thing. And I think this is the last one. Uh, again, kind of make it look like he's like maybe someone's stand ability. I like, kind of like this design with his eye, his hair. He's kind of more of the one point, but it's also kind of the jagged spikiness. They give him this weird earring that doesn't make sense. It, doesn't feel like it's right on his earlobe. It's also like broken or something. Um, the Jojo character looks again looks pretty good. You see this weird thing in the corner, which I think is supposed to be part of Donkey Kong's arm because it looks like that brown fur, but it doesn't make sense with him being way over here. Um, Jojo looks good. I think maybe the hair. This one looks a little weird with his position, so maybe not the perfect. But it did the Jojo character that it made up pretty well. I'm going with his earring is probably the biggest complaint. I'm not sure what this going to the shadow underneath his neck to the tie. That doesn't make too much sense. Going to the next one. I like how these ones. Uh, Dong Kong as a rock star. So this one's not too bad. Uh, I think it does the uh, hand symbol pretty good, but not white. Uh, maybe it does make sense, but it looks like it kind of gives like a hat, but also a headband, a media or something like that. This earring, I was going to say it looked a little bit better, but it still seems a little off. I think it would be, you would shift it a little bit. I love the jacket it gives him. Uh, the tie, you can see right here, the tie kind of shifts over after the neck of the guitar. Um, so the tie looks not just because of the logo, but it looks off that way. And the guitar, I feel like I see this with the other ones we're going to see. Um, it gives it a way too long neck, in my opinion. I think if the uh, body was bigger, and short in the neck. And then he also kind of gets these weird, like, little with the strings and all that. You can see knobs here, but only three. Um, looks like there's supposed to be a six string guitar, but it doesn't look like it's six strings here. So the guitar, uh, it's really weird with AI. Uh, maybe the tongue seemed a little off as well. I like it, it's sticking out, but it looks a little off. Um, type of fun design overall, but it definitely very flawed. This one's pretty cool. I, I think they did a really good job with the other uh, uh, shutter shades. Um, it looks like it gave him like a denim vest. I think this one, the body of the guitar looks a lot better. Uh, uh, but yeah, you see, like you get extra knobs, extra strings. I think with too many strings versus these knobs to adjust it. I think it's a little rocking, like the smoky effect. Um, the second doesn't look too bad. Um, so for the Donkey Kong render, hands look better. Um, I think probably the biggest complaint is like the guitar um, uh, neck looks really weird. Not too bad. And again, you get the weird uh, tie. But I think I'm more impressed with the shutter shades. That looks actually looks good on Donkey Kong. Oh, I like this one a lot too. So this one, uh, it, it goes went back to that simple 2D style, um, kind of like simple uh, with a hand. Um, kind of like it's funny teeth, like the like spiky ones. I probably would have made a middle one spiky too, because when they're flat like that, that looks off. Kook, I think. This headband, not, not too bad. But you can see with the neck of the guitar, I think it makes it way too long. Um, and also you can it kind of like shifts, like after it goes from one hand to his hand, closed hand, and kind of like shifts a little bit. This one this isn't too bad, but I think now you have seven knobs and like six strings. I'm not too much of a guitar person. Um, I'm not sure if, if this is supposed to be a tail. 
Um, I think this may be a stylistic choice right here for the background. Um, I confess, I think his tongue looks better in this uh, generation, this AI created creation. Um, but yeah, the guitar, you can tell some infraction here. I would probably fix the teeth here. I'm not an artist, but I, I could, I know what I like. So uh, I, I think it's one of my favorite ones when it comes to this prompt. This one looks really good too. Um, Get a more simple design with like jeans and the tie looks weird again. Um, I'm actually not too bad. I, I looked at, I uh, detailed the uh, denim, the shoes. Um, I feel like the guitar neck seems weird again with all these extra knobs, the little strings, all that. So I think if you like no guitars, um, what they're supposed to look like, that's all. I think the hair looks kind of weird. It feels like it's supposed to be a banana, a bandana that covers the whole head, but his hair's popping up where they could have made a headband and all that. Maybe the sunglasses look a little off. Yeah, that's not too bad. Uh, but Donkey Kong himself doesn't look bad with the random, with like what he, the guitar he's holding, the tie, um, the bandana is a little off, but not too bad for render. Okay, this one we have Donkey Kong as a boxer. <laughs> it is a tie, it's like Dong. Um, and it looks like the tie's a little skewed as well. Kind of simple. It's kind of weird that they give him one boxing glove and the other hand's not gloved. Man, banana, and his hair is a little off. Not too bad. The it looks like a weird cow leg for his hair. Not too bad. Besides the tie, saying dong, is kind of weird. This one, I, I feel like the expression just is too weird and blank and derpy. Uh, the tie again, logo's off. Okay, the feet look weird, but I think the number of toes match. Um, but then he has his tail. Like it looks like again, his tails look really off, like he's coming from his leg versus his butt. Um, besides his eyes expression, it looks off. I kind of feel like it gives more of a top heavy uh, proportion, which I kind of enjoy. But this one, the some things off with it, especially quit giving him a tail. And speaking of tail, this one has a tail as well. At least this one looks more um, like it's attached to his butt. Uh, but it looks almost like a dog's tail than a monkey's tail. Even though gorillas don't have tails but like any other monkey. Unfortunately, look good. The tie looks off. Um, the belt looks cool like his uh, uh, shorts and all that. Kind of give him a little more buffer body. Um, this one looks a little bit better in terms of like his stomach and all that. This one, I can really like the spiky hair being a little bit messier than his traditional like one spike. Um, again, toes, three, four, toes are off. Um, but I do like this background with the stars, so that, it's a, a, definitely a, a more complaints. Uh, but also lots of it look good, but definitely not perfect. Okay, then I put him as a karate master. And this one looks weird. Again, it goes for a simple style. But this is the blaring thing. This hand that's holding like this, but like this, but like, I, I don't know. Um, and then the headband, you have the knot of it, but you don't have the rest of the headband. It doesn't make sense. Um, the house looks good with his body in proportion, but this hand's huge issue and the headband's root issue and all that. So definitely off with this one. This one's not too bad. It kept things simple. Uh, None of this foot looks really weird. Uh, the tail, again, we have the uh, return of the tail. And one, two, three, four, five. Thumb. The hands off again, extra finger. Um, I don't like this tie. It looks like short and stubby. And a flower doesn't make sense. I'm not sure why I gave him a flower. Um, I would have just removed the tie and kept the karate gi, which kind of looks OK. Um, I don't know, it looks a little off. I would expect like more detail in the bottom part below the belt. But at least his face looks okay. I, I yes, I can give it to that. Another cry one. I kind of like this good dynamic pose with one, two, three, four, five, and a thumb. Again, yeah, and this hand like three. Uh, okay, this cry gi looks a lot better, but I feel like you cover up this peck as well. Um, like this side looks good, but then this side kind of like disappears. Um, weird tie again, uh, headband that doesn't make sense. I assume that's a headband. It's kind of hard to say. Hair doesn't look bad. Then he's holding like a random like 
Game Boy device as well, like the, the return of the little Nintendo device. And bananas, um, a lot of complaints like the hand. I like the dynamic pose, but like the gi right here should be more visible, I, I in my opinion. But let's see the next one. And he's holding like a game, uh, like a, a rejected Donkey Kong bootleg. Uh, this one. Besides the weird game he's holding, doesn't look too bad. I would have get, got rid of the tie just because it looks awful as well. I kind of like the texture of like the belt um, and the karate gi. Or at least this is like the uh, top part of the gi. Uh, if I'm saying that right, I might be totally off. I'm, whatever. But also like the three fingers. The fingers look off. You gotta expect maybe uh, another one. But his face, like, this one looks pretty good. And then you have Donkey Kong as an astronaut. Uh, this one looks really good. It some for some reason gave it kind of a somewhat pixel style. The tie ruins it. Like it's even off center and like slanted. If I if this tie is gone, I would probably say this would is borderline perfect. Um, yeah, it's kind of like Donkey Kong in space. This one is kind of weird. Like you see weird Nintendo stuff again, like the controllers. I'm not sure who this character is or this character down here. This weird and random, kind of a fun background. But they do some weird things. Like it, it looks like his helmet's closed, but his face is obviously popping out of the helmet. Uh, I don't know. It looks a little off, but it keeps simple with him being in the astronaut outfit. But this random thing, like random people and random Nintendo controllers that don't look like Nintendo controllers and all that. This one's a kind of a fun one. Um, it didn't give him a full suit, so it kind of gave him a, a just a helmet and jetpack. Again, it looks like this one, the helmet's open. Like, it's going to be the case if he's in outer space. Like, you can tell with the this part and then this part. I thought there's some reflections. It's kind of hard to tell what the helmet's doing. Like, it definitely wants to show his face, but then again, if it's closed, his mouth is popping through it. it doesn't make sense. But it's kind of fun that he's holding a rocket, but I think that is a thing that keeps having an issue with these. Uh, astronaut ones this one they made it more girly i'm not sure why he's doing three it looks like he's supposed to do like a, a peace sign but they got confused and did three you got two planet earth um it's weird like i'm not sure if this is supposed to be hair or like straps uh for the backpack but this one kind of makes i don't know if that makes sense with the helmet being open i think that's supposed to be open but then you see these reflective stuff here did he give him these eyelashes? It looks like long hair. I'm not sure why we have this girly looking Donkey Kong, but I thought that was really weird. This one's kind of interesting. Um, it gave him black fur for some reason. Um, again, less kind of a suit, just kind of a belt and a jetpack look of it. But it looks like the helmet's, yeah, with the reflection, it's like the helmet's supposed to be closed, but his hair's popping out, his mouth's popping out. So it's kind of weird how it puts Donkey Kong in a space helmet. So this one's kind of fun. I put uh, Donkey Kong as a cyborg. Um, this one kind of gives him like big arms. Um, kind of hard to really fault it besides this may be a little asymmetry with it, but uh, I thought it was kind of neat. Again, the, the tie with the weird uh, off logo. I thought that was pretty cool. This one was cool too. Um, it kind of gave him more mechanical body and this one looked like eyes look really cool. Um, it give him a tail, that's it. You got robotic tail now. Um, and I think his torso, it doesn't make sense as to how he's walking. Um, like It's like he twisted his uh, body to show more of his torso. And this is Dong <laughs> for the tie. So kind of a lot of random music kind of adds with the cyborg prompt that I used. This one's interesting too. It kind of made a more robot you can do with a face. Um, I'm not sure what he's holding. Uh, my fingers seem off here. Um, it's almost kind of hard. It looks like that's a robotic tie, but the tail. Why did he give him a tail again? So this was kind of interesting, but not too much to say about it. Besides, it, it just seems off. This one's cool, but look at the tail. And this one looks like a tiger tail. And super long. Um, I'm not sure why they made this arm more robotic and this one not with tan. Um, the glasses are kind of cool, like goggle glasses or whatever. The DK tie again is off. His feet, more toes on this one than that one. Uh, kind of interesting concept, but the tail is like the blaring thing that ruins it. 
This one's kind of silly. It kind of like makes him look, look like a more robotic face. They kind of give him a Mario-like hat with a little N, possibly for Nintendo. Ty looks off. Kind of interesting. Again, it seems like it's just as random stuff with the uh, uh, cyborg prompt. Like you can kind of see like cyborg using some of his arm fur and all that. This one, I, I think is pretty cool. I think this is probably the better of the cyborg prompt. Um, this part of his face looks weird right here. Like it's got disconnected. Um, okay, it looks not too bad with a knob, but it's like the barely readable Nintendo logo that looks off. I'm not sure why he says R on his chest plate. I'm not sure what that's for. Um, not too bad. Like definitely imperfections here and there, but this is not too bad for that prompt. And this one I put uh, Donkey Kong meets uh, Bigfoot. Um, this one looks very simple. Um, I yes. <laughs> like maybe Donkey Kong, uh, Bigfoot look like Donkey Kong. I think maybe the fur pattern on his face looks off. Uh, it looks a little off too. Uh, because it's simple, it's not too hard to criticize. I think his feet right here and toes is always an issue. This hand looks like an issue. I feel like you'd see more of his stomach if it's kind of going for that. Um, how the fur on his uh, belly is. Let's go to the next one. <laughs> I like this one too. I, now to give uh, Sasquatch a, a tie. I think the fur shadowing looks a little weird on his chin. Donkey Kong looks surprised, but this is like a nest control that looks a little bit more like a nest controller. But I feel like they made him too short, like weird proportions for Donkey Kong. Um, the big blue eyes look a little off too. I, I like this Sasquatch. Uh, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, we got too many toes. Too many toes in this one. A little bit better. It can, I find it interesting. Like the last one, we kind of like pixel art in this one, more uh, of a three D render. <laughs> that big <laughs> uh got me off guard. Uh, I know I've seen these before, um, but this one looks more like Bigfoot. Besides, like the toes again, too many toes. <laughs> Your little Mario, um, too many toes on uh, Donkey Kong as well. Things look just really off. Um, not sure what these random things in the bottom by Bigfoot's uh, feet are. Mm. I'm not sure if Donkey Kong would be this short compared to uh, Bigfoot, but this is actually not too bad. But when you start going down to like the feet and maybe the hands, it looks really off. But I, I like I like the top part. But I, I feel like this is art theft too, so I feel bad uh, with this one. Is that's a, a really good Bigfoot? Okay, I have Donkey Kong as a knight. This one. I like this. This kind of reminds me of uh, Rogue Legacy with kind of like his sword proportion, the fat sword. It looks like it tried to give him like a Hillian shield. Um, I wonder if shields work like that, like a buckler, because I always imagine like holding it more at the uh, end of your hand versus on your uh, forearm. Uh, not too bad, actually. This one I think is pretty cool, too. Um, I'm not sure what's going on with this hand. It looks like they're trying to give him a tail or something here, but I like the helmet. I like his more serious look. The kind of like the big, tough proportion. The sword looks pretty good. I know it's kind of cutting off uh, at a frame. The feet look off. So I kind of wish they would have given him just like actual uh, uh, boots uh, and all that, but it's too bad. I kind of, I kind of like that they incorporate the tie, but made him more like a handkerchief. Uh, and so I think this tail thing, assuming that the tail looks weird. Uh, maybe this hand and then his feet, but not too bad for uh, uh, AI generation. This one looks pretty cool too. Um, I think maybe with a simple design, it didn't do the thing with it around his eye uh, that matches the color of his uh, face and feet and all that, like the skin color. So it didn't, didn't make browns so of that feels really off. Give him a unique shield with like a bandana. It looks kind of like a happy face, all that. So I. I feel like when they put Nintendo in Knight, it tries to give him like a Zelda-like shield. Um, so I think the feet, that thing with the face, and this weird like, I'm not sure if that's a flag or in the background, that looks like it's supposed to be the Switch logo, but I'm not sure what that's all about. I think maybe the sword hilt is a little bit too long, but the blade looks better from other attempts I made. Um, this one's not too bad, <laughs> besides them being cross-eyed. Um, He's like holding the sword, but he has a sword behind him. Um, he looks weird. I think it's simple. Then you have the tail. 
the return to the tail, but kind of like the armor. But this one, I think the cross eyed uh, Donkey Kongs, the two Donkey Kongs, uh, ruin it for me. But it was interesting. Uh, I did the Dark Souls prompt again because um, I really like what happened with Bowser. Uh, this is weird. Uh, he's supposed to be a character from Dark Souls, he has his candle. Um, not too bad. I'm not sure why I did his style. Like, what's this extra be on his back? Um, I'm not sure why they put DS on his uh, tie for Dark Souls. Feet look a little weird. I found this one to be a little interesting, but it doesn't scream Dark Souls to me. This one, I like this one a lot better. Uh, for some reason, getting back to like a pixel style. Uh, the tail. We got the tail again. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be on his back, but it kind of gave him a little crown. Um, little armor plating here and there. Uh, this one looks really weird. Um, I think this screams more Dark Souls than the last one. But yeah, like the tail. It looks like the tail's still like from here, and then kind of goes up on his arm and pops up here. So a little bit better for it, but... Mm. Okay, maybe this was the best Dark Souls one. Like Kind of like the shoulder pads, the little armor, the helmet, shield. Um, it looks like it has a skeleton hand this way with the one. Um, yep, there's a tail. We got a Donkey Kong tail, and then DOS, like DOS. And I said, I appreciate that the fur kind of be more jagged and uh, textured that way. <laughs> this one's weird. I just want to include this one. Uh, I'm not sure why they gave fire on top, top and out at the top of his head. A weird blank look. Blade looks kind of good. It has this weird spike here. It doesn't make sense. Um, not too much of the armor. Uh, I just thought this was kind of weird and interesting. This the weird, like, realistic fire popping out of his head. And this would be the last prompt. This is uh, Donkey Kong in the suit. Um, this is cute, simple. I think he had this weird, like, tooth thing here, but not too bad. Just really shaped feet and hands. But I think just because of the like, cute style. It's going forward, but the bow tie looks pretty good. Give him bow tie versus his necktie. I think maybe this rose pin is a little off with this position. Like I put it more on the that part or whatever. It looks kind of weird, but not too bad. This one, he looks mean. But look, there's a tail, but this one looks like a fox tail or something like that. And give him a nice little top hat. And again, give him a bow tie. Feet and hand looks kind of weird, but again, I think it's going for a simple style. But the tail, this weird tail over here, uh, ruins it. This one's a little bit cuter. It kind of uh, fun proportions. Uh, could be a style, but look, this is like a tail again. It look, looks really weird. I'm um, coming to this. This might be passable. It, it does a good job with the uh, head, but the hat feels a little bit too small. I would give him a much bigger hat. And then. This one looks a little bit better. Um, it kind of has him taking a selfie. Um, I'm not sure if that's like a movie poster for a Donkey Kong movie. Actually, this Nintendo logo looks a lot better, even though the phone's covering up part of it. I think the T looks off. Um, and his face looks weird. Like he's like an action movie star, and he's like at the premiere, and he's like taking a selfie. I kind of have a green color, which is kind of interesting. Um, he doesn't really give him any pants, just like the vest, um, the top part of a tuxedo suit, whatever, um, all that. But it, it, I like this like fake uh, narrative that he's like an action movie star and he's at a premiere of his movie and all that. And that will do it for this video. So thanks so much for watching. Uh, let me know in the comments below uh, what were some of your favorites. If you ever want me to do a, uh, a blog page, like a, a social media account to have these uploaded, um, versus just in this video, I am going to save these, but yeah, let me know what uh, prompts I should use, what characters I should focus on, because I want to do more of these, just focus on sending characters. But that'll do it for today, so thanks so much for watching, and you have yourself a great day. Bye.